Row three points to lift them towards the promotion leaders. Well, possession plays all very well, but uh, Paul Bodin got over ambitious, did he not? With that pass, thank you very much, said George Lawrence. Bournemouth, a goal out. Well, an equalising chance coming up after Swindon's short corner. Lawrence uh, crashes into Tom Jones there. That did look a penalty, didn't it? And uh, Paul Bodin was uh, enabled to feel a lot better for his earlier mistake as he slotted home the equaliser. But after half-time, Swindon's midfield control not there and Bournemouth able to build in that section and watch for Lawrence's run now, setting up Luther Blissett for a superbly timed headed goal. A classy reminder of how Blissett once cost AC Milan a million pounds from Watford during his heyday. Well, worse followed for Swindon now, and again they're unable to stifle the visitors in midfield. And see now how John Gittins can't get a block on that centre, and Colwood doesn't get goal side of Blissett. And the man who once played 14 times for England helps himself again. Well, better tackling there by Colwood, uh, setting up the move for Fitzroy Simpson's shot and Steve White's. Tenth goal of the season coming up, but it's too late, really. Bournemouth are to stay that one goal ahead. And news just in that Timmy Parkin, who does not get in the Swindon side lately, he's been sold to Port Vale for £60,000, so it's goodbye.